Right now in Fairfax County, officials are announcing a new commission to review police practices. This comes in the midst of an investigation into a controversial police shooting of an unarmed man. And Jeanette Reyes joins us live this morning in Fairfax County with details. Jeanette. Well, Kelly, we're just a couple of hours away from that announcement about a 25-member ad hoc commission here that will oversee uh, police practices to ensure that they're following all guidelines. Now, this comes nearly two years after John Gear was shot and killed in the doorway of his Springfield home. He was unarmed at the time of that shooting. The department was heavily criticized for its handling of the case. It took 18 months and a court order for police to release its report. The Gear case generated increasing concern among county board members over how police shootings are handled. The ad hoc commission would review all policies related to critical incidents. It will include members of law enforcement, academia, neighborhood organizations, as well as the media. Chairman of the Board of Supervisors, Sharon Villava, says uh, she created this to maintain public trust, and one of the members on this board also says this is all for accountability, transparency, and to end the stonewalling many uh, saw during that John Gear case. Now, again, this specific part of the board meeting, the announcement, the announcement of that ad hoc commission is around 11 o'clock this morning. We will be live at noon today with a full report of what this commission entails and what we can expect as far as the details there. Reporting live, Jeanette Reyes, News Channel.